Okay, baby. What? Hey guys, it is Mother Daughter Thrift. We're back home. And by the way, you always see me on the daughter. This is son. This is my brother Hemingway. He does not look happy. So just know that there is a son in this equation too. Okay, what are we doing, baby? Okay, sorry. I had to show him because he's all over this suitcase. So I am going to open the suitcase. We have to flatten it. That way we could like set the camera up. So yeah. I just wanted to show. This is nice. What is that? Oh my gosh. Okay. I, even get into it. I don't know, but we're this is it, the big unboxing. This is yeah, this is the baby. And we have not gone ever all the way through this. No, like we saw enough where we were like, okay, we're spending some money. And then here. should we say how much we paid now? We paid either thirty five or forty dollars. And how much were we gonna go? We were gonna go like eighteen hundred. <laughs> I said a thousand, so oh my gosh, it looks like a disaster right now. Okay, so we are gonna put chairs down and we are actually gonna go through this with you because we only saw a couple key pieces that made us wanna pay that. So, all right. Oh, okay. All right, let's get the chairs. Okay, so here we are. We are so excited. Starting from all right, so our plan is to just. Go, go ham, it. go ham. I'm, yeah, because like we're absolutely going ham. I want to see the vest. Can we talk about the vest? Okay, well let's go. Let's okay, look. so this vest was one of the things I did actually look up. It's by this amazing brand. We watched some videos on it last night. The brand is called Who Decides War. Super neat. I really like the clothing brand and what it stands for. And there were like two pieces in here from it. And that, oh yeah, gosh. because there were... Feel, I didn't even notice that it's texture. Oh my gosh, because that is why, you know, we saw three key things to make us want to pay that much. Because... Oh, Tori, it is new tags. Tori did resale, sold, comps. Oh my oh, gosh. Oh my! This is U.S. dollars? Uh, I knew it was expensive online, but... I mean, we were oh thinking. Oh I gosh. thought it was like maybe a thousand. Because you did oh research last night. Yeah, this is one of the reasons we were paying anywhere from a thousand to a thousand plus. Yeah. Oh, this dress is amazing. Oh, Let's get you guys closer to see. Oh my gosh. Like, look at it. It's got all this print all over look it. Look at this. I think it literally it's just says who decides hard more. Hard to decide. Yeah, and then there's the tag if you ever see it. Kind of plain, but oh my. Oh my goodness, you guys. I don't know if you can see it says who decides to wear there. These are... Should I, I model it? Yeah, you want to put it on? I mean, this quality is amazing. Oh my god. I'm almost afraid. I don't know if I've ever had anything on that was $2,500. It is it 2X or extra large? It's extra large. Oh, yeah. I'm trying to get closer so they can see it. Oh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I got to look too close. Oh. I really like it. I got this cheap old Tory Burch backpack up here. Let's get rid of that. Yeah. <laughs> Loser. We don't need that. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. It is kind of boxy. I think for the price that it is, I think we should sell this. You do? I think so. I, I don't think it totally fits either of us right based on this. And I think I'd rather have the money. Okay. So next, pull out something else, baby. What the heck what is this? What if this is like Fendi or something? That's a rug. Yeah, do you see any sort of tags? Hmm. I never heard of that. What is it? I don't know. Some sort of rug. But is it, it called be... Modfa? Yeah, it might not even necessarily Modfa? be designer. He could have just got it on his trip. Let Here, let me search. Oh, yeah. I was going to hold it up. Here's what it looks like. It's just it's like a rug. I'm not loving it. Yeah, I'm um, typing the website. Oh, it's a prayer rug. Oh, a prayer rug. I mean, it's it's giving me like Fendi Versace vibes. And that, is it worth anything? Oh, they're only like $30. $30, but uh, it's still really neat. Okay, we're moving on. Okay. Okay, this is the other piece that I know is from Who Decides War. I think this is the only other piece. This is, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Now that one has a, oh, that one says 500. Yeah, 500. 500. Is, yeah, how much that was. Okay, it's got the tag, the original tag. All right, let's get them closer because they need to see this and you can hold it up. Um, 
So it's called the sunset shirt. Oh, look. But if you look, yeah, it's like it's like a sunset. And also, this is the shape of the tag. They must be famous for that shape. Yeah, and it's uneven, like all cool designer is. I really like the color fade on this, it's actually. New tags. Should I model it? Yeah, if you want to. Okay, Just let me be very tagging. careful. MSRP it's... is 500 yeah, it, he must have had it on sale. Yeah, I'm not really sure how I got these. But the thing is, we're also really sure that these are authentic. Oh, this is... Oh, yeah. Not only because of the quality, but, like, this brand really started in 2019, and this collection is 2020, I believe, the ones that we have stuff no, from. No, I thought it was 2022. We saw it last Oh, yeah, 2022, yeah, because we watched some videos. Oh, it's not bad. Um... I feel like I'd rather have money, but I do kind of like the unevenness of this. It's neat. Yeah, we'll have to see what the resale value is. Yeah. All right. This is like uh, Christmas. It is like Christmas. This brand. I think this is cute. I'm directing video today. I don't, I don't know why it says that like that. Well, it could be me. I'm usually filming. Okay. I know this is weird, but this one's not new tags. It smells really clean. Because that was something well, I was worried about, like smoke smell or something. could have just not had a tag on them. Okay, do we even know who this is? I don't really know this brand. It's puffy. I like puffy. We nice. might put a comp in here if we find something. Look at the big not, A. Yeah. I'm not really going to show you guys up close. Oh, it says by Cole Bennett. Cole Bennett? Cole Bennett. Okay, so yeah, I'm not really going to show you guys an up close because it's just pretty straightforward design. It does feel like really good quality, but yeah, it just know. says I'm directing video today. I like it. Cole it's, Bennett. Yeah, it's not even like proper grammar. I don't know what's going on. Okay, here, let me throw it over while you get the next one. All right. Oh, I like the look of this. Let's do that. Oh, I think this is the Stussy jacket? Stussy. Stussy? Stussy. 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 Oh. Oh, my gosh. What is, oh, oh it's the wait, it says something. I think it says Hype Boys. Oh, Hype Boys. Yeah. Yeah, because that's what it says on the front. Oh, my this gosh. This is cute. I love it. Does it have a price? Hmm. Knowing the brand, I'm going to say this is probably like $200. Because I, I have seen stuff from them before. Really? But usually, like, Y2K kind of vintage. Here, let's, let's show you guys an up-close shot. So, like, we just noticed this little tag in the corner. Work gear, Susie? I like it. It does. It looks like a like a high price Carhartt or something. There's the tag. Yeah, if sometimes this tag is recognizable for people. It's it's just a really nice. I love the look. Quality and look how they have like the S's is the pattern of the Hi puff. Boys, that's so cute. Yeah, it is really neat. And the embroidery on the back, it's just that same dice design but kind of bigger. I love it. I know. I really like it. <laughs> I know. What are we going to do? Okay. Pepper's casing the it. I know. These do unzip. I wondered if some rare th re thing there would be something down here. Some rare thing? Yeah. What okay. kind of rare thing would be in there? Well, like cash, like they hit it. Because my, my hand zips like this too. My okay, what is Okay. Ooh. This is Unfinished Legacy. It's an extra large. I like this one. Oh. I think it's kind of cute. Look at the butterfly. Is it's it? kind of like a waffle 180, right? Or something? Oh, just 80? Just 80. Just 80. Just 80. I just think it's really cute. And then show the butterflies on the sleeve. Oh, oh, I guess we'll have to get them up close to see this detail. Oh, are the skulls? Tori. Skulls and butterflies. Look. Look at the no. sleeve. Look at the sleeve. You guys need to come closer. Okay, Tori's going to get you closer. <laughs> so here's the big butterfly. It's kind of like a neat pattern. And then on the sleeves are all these, like, skulls and butterflies. Here, let me open it. Look at that. Skulls and butterflies. Let's go, baby. Yeah. And I actually really think the tag is cute. I need to. Unfinished legacy. Extra large. There's the tag. Can you see it? 80 bucks, though. I mean, I'm not going to walk in a store and pay 80 bucks for it. It looks like a thermal <laughs> underwear t-shirt. <laughs> oh, the, like, waffle pattern is weird. I love it. I love it. I do, okay. too. All right, now you pick the next thing out. I'm, I'm excited, so I'm going ham. But. Okay, so I'm just going to pick random, this purple thing. What am I picking up? All right, Ooh. so I'm going to pick it up. What does it say? God of, speed. Out of many, one. Uh, yeah. An eye and then a woman on the front. 
Oh, I think this is one of the brands I couldn't find online. Okay, what is that? Because I looked up some of these and took pictures to look up later. Maybe we don't need a close-up. Yes. Maybe we don't need a close-up. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's not yeah, like... You guys don't really get a close-up on this one because we don't really know what it is. It's just this. It looks like a girl. Oh, her head and the woman is coming out of an apple. So, like, super cool. The quality yeah. is not crazy on this one. I know. Maybe, like, biker vibes? But yeah. look at that tag. I don't know. It's from the 2000... It's, it's from, from the, the... <laughs> 2023 archives. So, very modern. Uh, it might be cute just to wear, but I don't know if it's maybe worth Maybe we're going to sell that. If it's worth money. we got to decide on everything we're doing anyway. Okay. All right. Let's look at this towel thing next. Oh, Sinclair. Ooh, Sinclair. Oh. Okay. This one doesn't have a size. Feel the towel. It's like terry cloth. Feel the towel. It's. A, I think it's a shirt. It feels like a towel. I, know, this one's I like Sinclair. This one smells weird. This one's very clean. Well, it's new with tags, and it does, I don't like it when they don't have a price. Uh, yeah, we oh, don't. it says the Towel Terry Polo. I told you it felt like towel. The Towel Terry Polo. Okay, so we're not going to show this one up close either, because it's just this embroidery. Other than that, it's like just a black polo. And you know what? You get out of the shower, and you don't want to dry off. You just put on the Terry Towel Polo. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad, but this is something else I wouldn't mind selling. It's not us. I know. I I. It, I think it's too big. Like if it was a little smaller, maybe it'd be cute. We don't want to drown in the material. Yeah. What's that? What? What's that? No. I don't know this. What oh is my this? gosh! I know what this tag. Oh. These are the. Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Oh. 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 <laughs> We're keeping this. Oh. We're keeping this. I can't believe we got this. Is okay. I know the tag. Remember that's oh the name that goes by. Runway. I mean, yeah, we just watched. I mean, we're talking vintage leather gray shorts. Oh my gosh, sixteen thirty. They had these on a runway. No, we're runway, gonna have to show it up close. A runway show. Oh my gosh. Oh my. You guys are getting closer. Gosh. I love them. So this is who decides war that the other stuff was. Look at these huge patches. It says who. Look at this. Decides. Work. I cannot believe. Oh my gosh! This, and look, you can pull this up, and this you can watch the fashion runway show. And in fact, you on. should. It's cool. Oh my gosh! The, it, Who decides? We can wear thirty fourth. And look. Oh my! You guys gosh. ready for this? Oh my god! Sixteen hundred and thirty dollars. No way! I'm so excited because this is my favorite thing by them is their pants. I wish they were full pants, and see, but it's okay. They have like um, this religious vibe going, and these are supposed to like represent stained glass windows. Yeah. So when you look at it, who but, decides war, guys? Oh my god! Really nice brand. Oh, Holy I love god. this. Yeah, the whole patchwork thing. Oh, oh my gosh! And there's the designer's name. That's what he goes by. Oh, oh my, my gosh! gosh. Hello. I had no idea these I were in know here. These were in there. Oh my gosh! These might be a keep. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was really good. I don't even know what to do next. Are these, how about, are these more pants? I don't know. How about this purple? Okay. Let's pull the purple out. You do, you do it. I'm too excited. Okay, the purple. Uh, there's two. Oh, it's gray. I'm going to do the gray. There's one with purple, one with gray. Um, oh, oh, it's, it's that brand again. Oh, wait. Does this one have a tag? Maybe it has a price. 130 130 That's the one that had the girl with the apple. Oh, it's the same design. Oh, it's the same. Oh, well, we got two. I guess this guy liked the design. We could dress alike at a flea market. Or we could sell this one because it's new tags and keep the other one. I don't know. A girl with an apple with boobs. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I can see a guy wearing it. Yeah, it's not really us. Yeah, 130 But it's weird. This tag, it just kind of has the name. And then, Is that the one that I said it said like Cody somebody? Oh, yeah, and this, this is Endless Supply. Endless Supply. So maybe that's the brand name, not this... Maybe that's the collection because it says 2023. Oh, oh no, 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 that was, I'm, I think it is somebody else. That's yeah. right. That was a different. All right. I got to pick out the next thing because I'm dying with excitement. I, big three. I, yes. I want, I want more jeans by Who Decides War. I don't know if we would have any more. Who's this? Whoa. Made with love. $130. For $130. Jeans. Who is this? Serenade. Serenade. Do you... Is that Serenade? Am I saying that right? Hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't like I sort of like the yeah. pockets. Certainly. It's giving me hiking vibes. I like it. Yeah, let's get them closer because we don't know this brand really. Yeah. 
There are 36. So what do we think? Okay, Serenade. See, like, I like the holographic dollars They're called Stacked. Stacked? Well, S Serenade S, 36. Yeah, and then they okay. have these. Oh, yeah, that's so. Oh, here. And they have, like, what? little pockets on the side. Oh, designed in Los Angeles. Hmm. Okay. So this might be really neat. I, oh, look at this. With the button. I'm already extremely grateful, but can I just say, if there's a pair of Who Decides War jeans in here, I'm going to lose it. It's got a little metal tag. I know. I really... Actually, I these are kind of like cool. A, but they're 36. I wear, like, a 34, I believe. Yeah, we can try them on to see how they I fit. Like them. Yeah, because I like them. Okay. I think this is the most excited I've ever been, like, ever. Yeah, because we are, like, designer freaks. Let's face it. Let's face it. All right, you All go right. next. Okay, I'm just going to pick, I'm going to pick this because it has purple on it and I lavender, and I love lavender. So I don't know who this is. Oh, it's Givenchy. Oh, Givenchy. Oh, wait, is it Givenchy or Givenchy? Givenchy. Oh. Ooh, what's it say? Mm. Oh, 75008 Paris. Oh, what is this? I wonder if that is. Oh, look, what's this? On? Oh, look, the Givenchy symbol. Oh. Uh, and the tag is so wait. nice. I thought it spelled a tag. Is no, it? I think it's just that. Oh. Okay, I thought it. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh! Um. Oh, what? my gosh! $590, and it's the original store tag from Saks Fifth Avenue. And like, this little case has all its little information in there. Casual fit, $590. For a t-shirt? For a t-shirt? Okay, let's get you guys closer to see oh this. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's talk about it. Well, it's, I think it's the address, like where their store's located. Oh, can anyone tell what this image is? Oh, it's a skull. Is it? Like, what's the Yeah, skull? look, because there's a nose, there's the mm -hmm. eye socket. I guess you're right. But there's something in the skull. I know, it's like merged. But that, I think, is their address, maybe. It's Givenchy. such it's nice like, quality. It's graffiti. Yeah. Look at the I tag. Really, I know, this is such beautiful, nice quality. Oh my gosh, Saks Fifth Avenue. I don't know, can you guys see it? 590. It's hard to focus, I guess. And then look. But yeah, look at the little like book thing. It, <laughs> the tag. Why it's so fancy. Something? Yeah, I, and then look here. This, look at the little. Tibetan. The back is plain, but it has the little embroidered in the middle. Hold it up to you. Because I think this could be a really cute oversized fit if we don't want to sell it. Because like that with baggy jeans, low key. Oh or even leggings, it could be like a dress. Yeah, some lavender Lululemon leggings. And I have them. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I pulled out a good one. All right, so Tori's turn. I hate to say I already know what that is, so I'm going to go for this. Yeah, because that was one of the things. Oh, a Sinclair t-shirt. Sinclair. Oh, I don't like it. Did he cut this or is it no, supposed to be that one? No, he didn't cut this. Sinclair for Sinclair. Yeah. I don't like these I don't um, like tank tops that are like tank tops. torn off. Well, like I'll that. tell you what, though. If you wore this like with Lululemon, because you have this color. Like, oh, yeah, like, a, like a cute sports yeah, bra. Yeah, and you had a sports bra, and then you like cinched it up, like and tied it. <laughs> Look at cool. that. Yeah. Okay. See, she has a vision for things where I really don't. I'm just. I love this fashion. Funny. I always have. Okay. Well, I don't know what it's worth. I yeah. honestly don't. It's Sinclair. So yeah, I'm not gonna and really it hold this have one. The tag. You guys aren't gonna get it up close because it's not new. It's just a Sinclair for Sinclair. I like it. Cute. And the brand is actually called Sinclair Global. Like technically, that's its full name. Because I kept trying to find comps on eBay and everything was the dinosaur. And I'm like, there has oh, to be yeah. I know. <laughs> the gas station. Yeah. So I was like, there has to be a way to actually Victoria find it. Victoria loves that dinosaur. I do. But yeah, if you search Sinclair Global, the clothing brand comes up. They may have had to change it to Sinclair Global for the sheer fact that if yeah, you wanted to find anything, that, anything you'd, online, you'd have to like deal oh. with the dinosaur. Guys. Oh. It's my turn. Okay. I'm going to go with this <laughs> odd. I'm going to go with this odd bag that says. C T M C -T and, and why is there a seven on it? Oh, it's an L. Is there something in a dust bag? Oh, I don't know. I never saw that. But it's. I think I said a seven. <laughs> it's L for large. I know. Okay, what am I getting here? Oh, some shorts. Oh, oh look at that. They're the potatoes. Look at the tag. They're like little potato people or something. Is that is that offensive? I don't know. Look. No. Oh no, they're money faces. What is C T M? It's a brand. C M T. That's. It's country music television. I so don't I think don't... that's what it is, but oh, I'm going to be honest. What is that? This tag. Is there a... Oh, look. 
It's got drawstrings. I oh, think let's get it closer. Suit, huh? Yeah. I th yeah, and I don't. This is a bathing suit because show the inside. Yeah, this lining and everything that looks like one. But look at this tag. Again, a brand we've never really heard of. And they have dollar signs, which is super cute. I love but it. It doesn't have a price, so we don't know really how much they're worth. But look at the faces. Oh, look here. Oh, yeah. Even that's the zippers. A, is that the zipper pocket? Yeah. And there's no price. Yeah, but look at this. I mean, I've... it is interesting that they come in these little plastic bags. To me, that says a little bit yeah. cheaper, but I don't know. No idea. Look at the guy, though. Yeah, like, these are really unique. Look at the eyes. I know. I love it. I love the look. Honestly, if it's not worth much, I could wear those. That'd be kind but of funny. Look at that. That's like, imagine wearing these to the beach with, like, a camo bikini top. That'd be cute. This is crazy. Oh, there it says it. I love the dollar sign. So that's their crazy. trademark. Okay, we yeah. have nothing about this. Nothing about this. We might have to put some comps. Okay. So, okay. Okay, I'm, I'm going to go next, there. and I'm dying to know what's in this, like, recyclable tote. What, what is, is it really a recyclable tote? Uh, I guess maybe it's not like a thing. Oh, these are just men's Nike. Nike? Yeah, $35 retail. Is that retail. a step down for the guy? Oh, do you think he was a basketball player? Because that's a Billy team. Kins. And Who's look, Billy Kins. These say it too. Do you think he played on this team? Do you think he played Who? on this team? St. Louis? Do you think he's a... I mean, to own these clothes, is he a famous basketball player? Because they all have that team name on them. We don't know anything about sports, but... Lost luggage. He could have been traveling. Who? Well, if his name was on the stuff, I mean, then they could have returned. Yeah, that's true. But St. Louis, I don't know anything. Or maybe it's just a team he liked and he bought stuff for it. I don't know. Also, this is a plain white Calvin Klein t-shirt. Nothing special. Not going to hold it up. Yeah, uh, I'm also not going to really that put them close. But then again, he didn't wear them because... It's, yeah. But, but yeah. Look, look, look at the Nike. Brand new. I mean, they're just cute. They have the team okay, name down there. The, yeah, here, hold, you hold them back and I'll put this here. Look, guys. Is this a uniform? Did is this, our did this guy famous? I mean, famous? to afford all this? What if he was a famous Maybe. basketball player? Oh, I'm dying. I see denim with paint splatters on it. It's my turn next. Okay. Yeah, again, Calvin Klein blank oh. white. So that's not really anything. This is like twelve dollars on Amazon. Yeah, well, it's, no, but it's comfy. No, like I he could probably use that later. like under or something. Yeah. Okay. okay, so this is a kind of an interesting piece. This. Yeah, because it makes you wonder who is this guy. I mean, I'm gonna go for this because okay. it's right on. Well, top. well, do them together because we know what we kind of saw this when we yeah, were looking. Yeah, because we had we saw only a few things. What we did was we were so afraid that everyone would look in the suitcase. We randomly only pulled out a few things. And this is one of the things we saw. So help me, baby. Okay. This is really nice. This is that brand Sinclair. We're going to have to get you guys closer. This is a full, like, Sinclair basketball uniform. Here, you hold up that. Yeah, you hold that and I'll hold this. Okay, flip them inside out. They're oh, they're, they're inside out? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay. So we're going to get you guys closer in a second to see the details because these are amazing. It's a full Sinclair, like, basketball uniform thing. Oh, my gosh. This is crazy. Okay, let me lay them out here. So. And is this supposed to yeah, be champagne? Yeah, the champagne is like kind of their thing. I mean, it's really, I know you guys can't feel it, but it's such high quality. And then look here. Sinclair, and then when you. Extra large. Oh my gosh. I know, this, okay. Look at that. Since this was so unique, this is one of the things I saw. Like used, there are sold comps for 300 for the jersey. Used. Because they don't make these anymore, at least not in this color. I think they switched to like blue and white. So this was used like three hundred, and there was no comps for this. Yes, because that was one so, of the things. That's one of the only things. So my reasoning was, why don't we sell it? That. Yeah, why don't we sell it together for five hundred on eBay? Well, I'm not really loving it. I don't think we would ever wear something like that. I kind of like the jersey. Actually. Yeah, I sort of like it, but I'm not wearing it. Yeah, I think I'm too old for it. I'm coming in hot. Tour's turn. This is the one piece that I wanted. Oh, you saw this ahead of time. Yeah. Because it is a Givenchy. Givenchy. Givenchy t-shirt. But it comes with little distressed tears. Look at the collar. I mean, we make tears. Yeah, and it's it's so cute. I love it. And I really like the big size. Because like some basketball shorts. Oh, this is so tour. cute. Remember the other one had the skulls? Yeah. Here, let me hold it up so you can see. Oh! The glasses are going on. This 
one's even more expensive. Oh my gosh, and it's from Saks Fifth. Seven hundred dollars for a T-shirt, and it's mine. Okay, look. I, oh, we gotta get okay, closer. You guys gotta come wait, see the detail. I want to show you the. Okay, show me uh, first before let's you see, show them. Those, the skulls that were in the other. Okay, so this is like my favorite thing because I love the distressed look. I can't look. believe. Look at this. Look Guys, at this nice. looks like 1950s. Like, a little tear. We, we tear the things to make them yeah, look like Yeah, like this. vintage is such a in style. And there's the tag again. Kind of hard to see in this lighting. Oh, and look at how nice. It's like thick and it has all the paperwork in there. It's almost like a booklet. Yeah. Oh, here. Let me turn that for you. Oh. Did you guys see that? Six ninety. Can the camera focus? Uh, it is a little bit. Hey, look. Yeah, what is in here? Because the other one was missing its card. Yeah. Is this authentication for the t-shirts or, or is maybe, this care? Oh, this is care. Oh, okay. Honestly, if it's a seven hundred dollars t-shirt, I wouldn't be surprised if it did have authentication. Oh my gosh, this is but, probably the softest t-shirt. But it has. I mean, the Saks Fifth Avenue <sighs> tag. Jeez, seven hundred. Okay, hold it up. Was there anything on the back? Oh my god. This is fab, fabulous. I love it. I love how dark it is. And then look. Look down below. Oh, yep. Down in the bottom. And I apologize for the bad camera work. I'm literally so excited. I I started to tear up at the auction. So, I could not. So, well, the tearing <laughs> up was because... We, we were, were going to try go, to go a yeah, thousand. Yeah, we were going to go a thousand. And then we were going to baby push it a little. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so this is probably going to be my first pick because it's my favorite thing in the suitcase so far. Okay. So I'm going to pick this weird thing that looks like a donut. Oh, oh, it's another. It's it's another one of the money. Oh, does this match the shorts? Oh, yeah. Or here, hold that on. That's oh, yeah. Uh, oh, this one has stuff on the back. It too. looks like potato money. Oh, wait, it's CTM. It says chase the money. Oh, CTM. Chase, chase the money. Chase the money. So, the, okay, now we can probably search the brand because I didn't know what that stood for. Too bad they don't have prices. No, do you see anything on that tag? Mm, oh, no. We'll have to just try to search it and put in a comp or something. Or are you going to look right now? They look like, I mean, I'm getting oatmeal cookie like. Since we already showed the cookie. other one with the same pattern, just hold it up and I'll find you a comp. Yeah. See, doesn't it look like an oatmeal cookie? I, I'm, I'm going to say oatmeal cookie versus a potato since it's so classy. Because I guess, I bet you it's $100. Everything else was. Oh, it is $100. But you found it? <laughs> yeah. See, that's it. Hundred dollars. That's the exact design. Is that used? Yeah, used on the hype boys. On the hype boys, but ours is new with tags. So, I mean, what would be the retail be? Um, I'm having a hard time actually finding the company because apparently there's like a, I think it's a Juice World or something. There's some popular rapper that has a song called "Chase the Money," so that's what a lot of this is popping up. Yeah, and see, look. It's got like initials. It could be the thing like the Sinclair Dinosaur versus the Sinclair Global or whatever. Yeah. Okay. I mean, some of these are really kind of unheard of brands. Put this over so Tor, get ready. Okay, so I am going for this t shirt here because it looks really interesting. I'm trying to figure out what it says. And real quick, there's one of these bags. I think it's for the bathing suit. Oh. It's by a brand called Reeves? Reeves? Is that what it says? Reeves? I don't know. I'm not very good at brands. What is this? It is. Oh, oh it's Grand Picks. Racing team? Oh, Reeves Courses D Grand Prix. Um, oh, it's the it's that big race that everyone does. Look at the back. You know what I mean? Reeves one Grand oh, hey, Prix wait, wait, racing wait. team. There's a tag. Look at the tag. There's a tag. Uh, is it like is it the one in Monaco? I mean, yeah, I know that one. Maybe. Do you I've think been, you traveled know, of there? Of course. Um, but that it doesn't have a price or anything. Is there another tag? No. Look on the inside. No. Well, it's new with tags. Okay, let's get you guys closer because we don't know really what this is. Uh, yeah, it could be the official racing team for uh, the Grand Prix. So yeah, I think it is this, like, uh, the race. It's a map. But the thing is, is this a designer, like, that made it? Because who is Reeves? Look at the course, and it's, like, got all the information. Do you think it's in Monaco? I, mean, I it really looks like don't it. know. And then look at the tag. I mean, this is really good quality. It's thick. It's so thick and soft. It's crazy. All right, let me uh, show him the tag. Yeah, because look, look at this. Oh, wait, here. You can't see it because of the light. Yeah, look at that tag. We just don't... And that's not in English. Oh, is it French? It looks like it. I don't know. Spanish, actually, because it has the things. Can you hold it up and we can see the back? I mean, again, it's big, but I like it. No, honey, the back. 
Yeah, I don't know. I sort of like it. I sort of like it, too. We got to do research because we're not totally sure on what it is. Okay, I like it. Guys, I'm gassed up. I'm wondering what this is here. orange? This is... What is that? What? Hellstar? For some reason, I think I know this no, brand. No, wasn't Hellstar from The Suicide Squad, like one of no, the Marvel no, no, no. movies? Well, it is called Hellstar. No, I know, but I, I think I know it as a brand. Is there a price on it? No price. Look at the activity Oh, these bands. are so Well, cute. what do you call these? Back in my day, it was like a windsuit. Like, like tracksuit bands? A track sort of? suit. Yeah, um, let me look these up because I don't know what these are, but they look really fancy. No. Oh my gosh! Used! Oh. Hold on. Let me, let me first of all see how much they are on their website. These are brand new with the tags. They're medium! And our guy is pretty much a large. I love these. Okay. Oh, look. It has an authenticity code, too. Used, these are like $250-ish. Um, there's a pair listed on Grail, used for $500, on StockX for $330. They don't make these exact ones anymore from what I'm seeing on their website. Like, this is like two minutes of research. But the ones on their websites are all different colors or different material. But so, these were on some resale websites. So, who had them for 500 Grailed, I think. Okay, well, ours are new with tags. So, if they had them... Even a new, if we got like a 200 That cool. even if they were used for 500 is this one of those crazy, like, retailed for eight? I mean, what are these? Uh, it didn't look like they retailed it high. Oh, okay. It, it looked like they retailed for around two or three, but since they weren't being made anymore, they were selling for more. Yeah, you never know. Sometimes when something's discontinued, um, tap but I was thrilled. For, oh, oh my gosh. Tap for authentication. This, okay, we gotta get you guys closer. I know what this is. Oh, I know what it is. Okay, so we know what this is. We've seen this in like other higher end designers. This is like an actual, what's it called? NFC code, that's what it is. Yeah, if you tap your phone to this special patch, it'll automatically bring up the information and it's authenticated. So, like, look at that. And then this little tag. Instead of the old days, like where Louis Vuitton and Gucci serial numbered things, now they're All microchipping star. high end. Yeah. That's a microchip. Well, oh my basically. gosh, I can feel it. it. It's in there. The microchip is actually. Look at it. Yeah, this is a really neat oh, brand. Microchips, a pair of. <laughs> Sweatpants. I mean, okay. seriously. <laughs> Be nice to them. Yeah, I mean, this is great quality. I want to do more It research. says Hellstar on, like, everything of it. Hold them up for a second so we can see them. Oh, my gosh. I definitely want to see what these are. Really. And I know, sorry in advance, we're moving fast. We're talking fast. We're very excited. I'm sure you can understand, but, oh, my gosh. My pick, I'm going to go for these uh, orange pants right here. Oh, they're that same brand. It actually looks like these are too. Oh. Um, yeah, the Serenade brand. Look at how it's like a burnt orange. Yeah, like they really distressed them. I like it. Yeah, I kind of like that look. Oh, look, they're, they're, they're sort of neat. I'm, yeah, they got neat buttons. Yeah, you're right. It looks like when you run an iron across something and it... Yeah, I'm going to get it close. Uh, I'm not going to show you these because, I mean, it's the same up close. Oh, it's like oh. the light. Yeah, <laughs> show them. I mean, they're really neat, burnt orange. They have the tags. Do they have a price on them? No, I didn't think the other ones did either, right? Oh, look. They have safe stuff inside. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change. The courage to change the things I can and the wisdom to know the difference. Oh, That's cool. So it says that on the inside pockets. Pants with a meaning. Pants with a meaning. Oh, and you know what? I bet this person really liked meaningful clothing brands because that's all about who decides war. Yeah, that's the, in the religious. Look at that. Tori was, it's like a Lululemon. It's, it's got an S for serenity. I like these. Yeah, I like serenity. serenity. Uh, I think they were 36. 36. Okay. I mean, they're, I mean, we can wear 30. Oh, gosh. They're a little 36. I think we can wear them. Maybe European. Oh. Um, all right. So. I'll go ahead and just do these because I know yeah. we just, I see the pockets. So these are the same, um, or are they the same Serenity? Oh, Serenade, I mean. These, I think, so we have two pairs. The guy oh, must have really liked these. 
So we have, I think the, they're only reach oh my for gosh. Right? We have two pairs of the same pants and two pairs of the, two shirts. We ought to dress the Oh, like. we should. Or fun. Like go to the bins or something and be matching. These ones. Yeah, I'm five hundred dollar outfit. Wait, these ones are not new tags. Maybe he actually wore these. No, they're so stiff. Well, I know, but it doesn't have the tag. But they could be newer. I mean, maybe he cut the tag I off. I really like the this bottom. mission statement on the okay, inside. Okay, see if that one says the same thing. It does. It does it. It must be the brand thing. Oh my gosh. So yeah, we're not gonna get you guys too close. It's just the same thing, but it's like a washed out gray sort of look. I love that. Well, these are thirty four. Why did he fluctuate in size? And the medium on those Hellfire so, pants. I, and I, I hate to say, these do look kind of smaller. So maybe, maybe they, work. yeah, maybe he tried them on and went down a size and up a size because they could be the designer. Okay, you're next. I have to know what these are. I, I know. There's a pair I'm of pants too, and it doesn't have the Serenity tag, does it? No, something El John Elliot. Ser serendipity. Who? John Elliot. John Elliot. Right on the inside, John Elliot. Oh. I don't know John Elliot. Let me see. Oh my gosh. No way. Oh my. Six hundred dollars. So let's look at these. I really like the look. Look at the little bag and the, the cards in the bag. Oh my oh. gosh. Okay, we have to get you guys closer for these because look, this might be one of those brands where they're hand that's painted. That's hand painted because yeah, that's it's real actually paint. cream cracking. Come close. Okay, let me go ahead and spread them out a little better. Okay, okay so these are like beautiful. So there's the tag, John Elliott. John Elliott. Okay, let me flip and show them. Yeah, do you see that? Oops, oh, sorry. Whoa, sorry. 600 five. It's $568. Okay. Well, with tax. Yeah. Well, and it's just amazing. I mean, really. The days to Pollock, too. Okay, so maybe we could look name. up. And look, this tag. It's got like a little card in it. Bright on the inside, it says. So and maybe that describes like and how And look at this. It. I mean, you can see that this is real paint because it's cracking. And he has done paint all the way down them. This is gorgeous. I mean, we really should look up his art and see what yeah, else let me he turn does. Them over. Oh, and look at buttons all the way up, which I like. <laughs> and um, there's like no tags, so you they're know, very subtle. You could wear these, and you wouldn't know if you have a six hundred dollar pair of pants on, or ten dollar pants you made. Ten dollar pair of pants. And there's that old saying: if you know, you know. Yeah. It is. Which I want to know. <laughs> yeah, we want to know. I want to know. I mean, I, I kind of like these. These are really neat. This is okay. this is the big deal in here now. Yeah, this is one of the reasons that I was going to take my money and buy this. Because there was something in here, and um, it was in the bottom, and it was something I really wanted. Glitter. It was something I really wanted. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and get it out. The baby. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Oh, I did not realize it was new tags. That really gets me. This is something I have always wanted. Oh, oh my god. It's a Louis Vuitton denim jacket. Last night I looked on the website and it is still for sale. How much is it on the website? I can't remember. It was like twenty three. Look, he crossed it out. Twenty three hundred dollars. He paid two thousand eight hundred and seventy dollars so that's how much he paid two thousand the store tax on it two thousand eight hundred oh my gosh okay so here's the tags okay we need to get you guys closer like asap wait no no i'm putting this baby on okay all right so guys Oh, okay. So this is it. You're so now, far away. Come, come I think I'm going to have to probably roll the sleeve up a little. I don't know if it had a cuff. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's like, the, I think it's meant to be up. I may have to, because look, it's, yeah. it goes, it's at a weird angle. Oh my gosh. But The pockets, they're like two layered pockets. Okay. I don't know if you can see. I don't think I've ever owned an article of clothing, <laughs> of course, that was too thousand eight hundred dollars so with tax this is a three thousand dollar jacket look at this. oh my gosh and look at how nice like the button is the zipper is look at the all zipper. of it there's not a there's not a doubt in our minds that any of oh. this is fake oh, like no. are real I mean, we know it's all real yeah oh my gosh guys what do you think i think it looks cute on you i think you deserve it you're beautiful i love it i love you oh, and the thing is i mean it's flashy, but if I'm just wearing it like this, 
Okay, I just need to show the tag now. Look at this one. Louis Vuitton. Oh my gosh. And when I read the price, oh, is there something in here? There is. Okay. But it's kind of hard to see. It's been crossed out. You have to catch it at, like in the right lighting. What's in the... I'm sure it's the care instructions. Yeah. I just I, I like this chain. It. Yeah, maybe we'll work on it. But yeah, you can. And even all the little buttons say Louie. You're not gonna be able to see that. The pattern's too busy. The camera doesn't know where to focus. Oh my god. <sighs> oh. I love. Look at that. This is your baby. Look Are you gonna this. name your baby? Oh my gosh! Look, even the bottom, yeah. the zipper. I showed that earlier. I just that. love it. I like the way this is lined. <gasps> Look, even there. the inside of the snap is marked. Okay, what are you gonna name it? Louie. Of course, it's King Louie. Oh my gosh! Oh look, even the inside snap. Fifty made in Italy. I don't know what else is in. I don't that. know. I, I I have to go for this big thing. Right I here, went numb cause... after I saw that. I don't know what this is. I know. Is it inside out or is it supposed I don't to? Know. Look it that looks way. like a chrysanthemum. Oh. I think it's supposed to look. I actually sort of like this. Oh. oh, and oh, 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 my gosh. 160. That seems no cheap. No way. Oh, no, MSRP is 450. I think some of these maybe he got an outlet or something because it'll say the marketplace value and then it'll say like 160 well, or a few hundred less. You know what, though? That's the real store tag. I'm thinking it was on sale. Maybe, yeah. Oh, my gosh. But this is that's Look the cathedral the... that we were telling you about. No, they're going to have to come closer. They okay. can't see it from her. I love this. Oh my gosh. I never would have expected that that was. So show me the highlights here. Okay, first of all, this is what we were telling you that he was doing like some things like maybe involving Who religion and the stained glass window pattern. And then if you look over, you know, at our other one, mm -hmm. the shorts. Same pattern. Yeah, and then that is the real store. And that's probably the sale price. Uh, and then the tag is so like, this one's orange, the others were black, which is interesting. But it, see how they have like these big eye things and this, the flowers, the lace. I like and it. That, that goes all the way through, I think. Yeah, it's, it's like an actual pocket, yeah. Look at that. I mean, these are beautiful. Here, let me hold up the, and look at the back. Oh, oh my gosh, yeah. So it's kind of got the tie-dye swirl, the flowers. I, I like it. Oh man, I'm just like astonished. This is so cool. It has a lot of detail. It has a lot of yeah detail, and it's very busy, but in a good way. I have no idea what this could be worth. I know. Yeah, it's like a t-shirt of some sort. Okay, so what do you think, Tor? First of all, it's not new tags, but it looks pretty. But I don't know about this design or anything. But they're not like six 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 like the devil number. They're like in a circle. So maybe, maybe, maybe they're nine nine nine. True. It might be like an angel number or something. All right, yeah, let's get you guys know. closer because we don't know what this is. Yeah, I don't even know what it says. So this is an absolutely crazy pattern. I don't know I mean, what this even says. W R L D. Yeah, we cannot really tell. I mean, building the future youth. Oh. In the year 2085, the fashion industry has become a powerful tool for educating the youth about the importance of sustainability and WRLD Labs. So, like, this is, like, a whole thing. Look, WRLD Labs. I don't really know what this is. I'm not going to read the whole thing. I don't thing. know. You know what? Maybe it is, maybe it is like, 999, and it has to do with something good if it's talking about yeah. educating children. Yeah, I don't know. About st sustainability. Mystery t-shirt. Yeah, we'll have to put up a comp if we find it. Okay. There, it looks like there might be two things left. It's your turn. Uh, which one do I want? Oh, this one, obviously. Oh, it's that brand. What was the one with the... Oh. Yeah. Hellfire. Hellfire. Oh. Oh, oh Hellstar. Hellstar. I think that was the... What was yeah. it? Uh -huh. Oh, my gosh. What Harley the... Quinn? No. Was it Hellstar? And... No, there's not a... Super... Suicide Squad. No, but it's not... Okay, we're cutting all that. No, Pepper, it's not what it's called. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. The cat is going... It's too bad to go in. Cause it's Where's the front so out? Where's the front out? All right, okay. Okay, anyway, cut that. Cut, cut, cut. So it says on the back, 
uh, release. Or, oh, wait. Reach your inner peace. Reach your inner peace, Hellstar. Oh, I really like and this. And it's the girl. Yes. Yeah. I like Let's it. Let's get you guys closer because this is a beautiful oh graphic. Gosh. This is one of my favorites. So this is a skeleton like meditating. And look, that it has must the, be logo. the symbol or logo. Hellstar. And it, it, the one thing I like yeah, is look how good. crackly. It looks like it's you know vintage. Yeah, it's like, supposed to look that from way. From the eighties or nineties. There's little stars all over it. Hold up the back. Okay, first of all, so you can see it perfect. <laughs> so cool. I love it. Reach your inner peace. Hellstar. I like it. <laughs> I, I wonder if it glows in the dark or anything. Okay. <laughs> All right. So this is it. We have one item left. Oh! <laughs> I'm in love. Oh my god. I didn't even. It's supreme. It's. Oh, it feels so nice. Oh. I've only ever owned one supreme short, and it was fake. <laughs> I think I own a supreme bag. Yeah, I think you do too. Yeah. That I've never even used yeah. because it's so fake. It's the equivalent of a trash bag. And it's made in the USA. That's neat. Oh my gosh. Let's, oh, it's huge. Let's oh. bring them closer. So yeah, you guys see. have to see. This is a beautiful okay, pattern. Okay, go get the thing. There's no tag on it. It feels new because it's like sort of stiff. The Supreme, large, made in the USA. Again, I did not know their stuff was made in the USA, so that's cool. Look at the pattern. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, I really like the strawberries and the cherries. I like when they use like Renaissance paintings. <laughs> They've yeah, done that a few that times. They did that. But look, yeah. it's huge. I know, and the graphic is so tiny compared to the shirt. And then, is there anything on the back? No, no. Back is plain. Okay. All right. It's so, so nice. This, I think, is it. <laughs> Are we scrounging for more? Yeah, I want more. Um, Was there anything in the outside pockets? No, there were no there outside were no pockets. Outside. And the thing is, oh I'm going to use this suitcase to go to Florida because this is a nice. Hard side suitcase. Okay. All right. We'll update so, you guys in a little bit. Well, do we want to tell them what we're doing? We have an idea. We decided that the most fair way to do this, because we both love everything, we both love designer, is decide. Well, are we deciding well, what we're selling? Well, first? originally, what we were going to do is if we paid a lot of money for it, we were going to sell enough items. Like if we had to pay $1,000 today, yeah, we would have we had to sell. Like we're going to sell $1,000 to make it all free. Which could have been one. We spent $35. We are so excited. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity. We're never going to see these brands again. These are rare brands. We're going to just pick what we want and what we don't want. Then we're going to sell for a profit. Oh. So we're going to so, lay it all out and go, you pick, I pick. Pepper starts because she like, Paid. I paid for it. But I know it's only $35. I but know, but still. oh my gosh, yeah. Um, but. So let's lay it all out and then do yeah, it. Yeah, we're going to let you guys see what each of us pick. But today, I mean, for the entire auction, we did pay $530. Yeah. But, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we just did some math here. We laid everything out and we're looking at it all. Amazing stuff. We're super happy. This is going to blow you guys' minds. <laughs> we just calculated. There are 30 items. And we paid. And we paid $35 for the suitcase, which means each item is a dollar and 16 cents. A real Louis Vuitton $3,000 monogram jacket. We paid $1 and 16 cents. Oh my gosh. Okay, we have a plan. We have a plan. So, okay, so our plan. <laughs> Jam. I can't even believe this. Okay, I'm lost story. So our plan is, we decided oh. these brands are rare. We're gonna take turns picking, and then when we're done picking what we really want, all the rest is gonna be sold. Because be, be, okay, because realistically, a few oh. things. And the amount we paid. And we do want to do research. With St. Louis. I've heard of St. Louis Cardinals, but that's not a Cardinal. Yeah, maybe this isn't know. even a major team. It might just be like college. Team. Okay, rich but college anyway. kid. So anyway, we're gonna pick. But also, we're going to be a little realistic because some of these items either won't fit us or like are too big. That yeah, one's too short. big, or maybe like it's literally okay. not our style. You know. And the thing is, I am picking because I really like the item, True. not because it's super valuable. So True. that's how I am choosing my items. Okay, I'm picking first, and it is the baby. This is mine, and this is what I wanted to pay a thousand dollars for. So. And I know it's crazy, and this is mother daughter thrift. We're thrifting. I didn't pay a thousand. I paid a dollar sixteen. A dollar and sixteen cents, and it's new with tags for eight. What 
2800 right? 2800 And it's still for sale on the website. Okay. So um, that is my pick. So that's claimed. Okay. I already know what my pick is going to okay, be. Okay, so Tori's going to go next. Yeah. Well, we're going back and forth. Oh, my god. The Givenchy t-shirt. The $600 t-shirt. Uh, yeah, this one was, was it 600 or 670 I don't something? know. I got to decide what I want. $690 for this t-shirt. It's mine now. I, I don't even know what the pick. I, I like this. It's so unique, but it's also kind of you. The flowers I love, in the, the brand is what I really love. I love it because it's got pink on it. I love the chrysanthemum. It does have embroidery. I love the chrysanthemum tea. And these weird eye. Because look, is this supposed to be an eye? I don't know. Should I take this? Honestly, probably. That seems very you. It does. I love funky. I love funky my whole life. Okay, so. Don't be mad at me, but I know what I'm okay, going for I'm going to set my over here. Oh, and the other thing is, guys. Just because we're doing this doesn't mean we don't share. We share all the time, so oh, yeah. keep that in mind. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I, I, I'm thinking Lederhosen. Aren't these the German leather pants? I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. Because what are these? $2,000 pants? Yeah, these are $2,000 okay. leather shorts. Sweetie, I'm not even sure if how to dry clean those. I just don't think you ever wash them. <laughs> Because they're leather with giant patches. We actually <laughs> never. Do you just them. never wash them? For breeze? The, for me. Um, the I don't know. The other day I did wash and submerge an entire coach leather purse. We're not uh, going to do that with the, with the $2,000. Okay. Okay. Oh my I'm putting these over in my okay. pile. Um, I really sort of like, I, I mean, I sort of am liking this. I don't even... That this. is really cute. And because you is... wear a lot of sweatshirts, crew necks. Now, guys, here's a classic example. This had no tag on it, and I don't know the brand. Yeah. I just think it's fun because I'm directing a video. I'm the one who edits all these videos. So, I so think we'll it's put fun. in maybe a comp if we can find this. It's just because I love it. But I'm guessing it's at least $100. It has to be. Okay. So, yeah. that's... You've got two things. Okay. Okay. It's Taurus turn. Gosh. I am going to go for the Hellstar... Um, oh, skeleton meditating. I I really like kind of like skulls oh imagery like that. I think it's amazing. I don't Out of know. everything here, I'm thinking this is what I'd probably wear the most, oh. like next in line. Oh, <laughs> the pressure, pressure, the pressure. Don't forget we have the sunset button up with the stained glass silhouette and the vest. <laughs> Who's gonna get the two thousand dollar vest? I feel like I would spill my coffee on it. Are you thinking maybe sell it? I don't know. How much can we get for it? Like five hundred dollars. <laughs> New tags. There was one that sold on Grailed. Grailed. New tags for like seven hundred dollars. So I think if we put it up on eBay for five hundred, accepted anything over four maybe. <laughs> Cause like it's it's cute, yes. But think of how far four hundred dollars could go. Yard sale and season the at the bins. Yeah. So I'm thinking maybe now. Oh that is very you too. I the stussy jacket. The stussy. But would you wear something that says height boys with the Dyson? I don't know. I mean, like Vegas. Let's go to Vegas just so you can wear your jacket. I, I sort of like it. Well, wait a minute. Why? Okay. I I might want this, but I, I want to make sure it fits. I don't want it if it's not going to fit. Oh, it's big. But I don't want oh, it to big. be too big. But then again, imagine some grunge pants. And I have so many grunge pants. I kind of like the fit. Okay, you need to go look in the mirror real quick. It it boxes up, so you need to make sure it like. Okay, let me go look in the mirror. Tor, scope out your next item. I already know what my next item is, you guys. Oh my god! It's kind of cute, right? I love it. I mean, so How it's much is this one? This one was like two something retail. Okay, yeah. So the stress is not crazy, but if you find But vintage... I think this could be like um, a very casual, and I am not a dress up person, as you guys can see. Really. All right, I don't know. This Did it have a tag? I don't know. We don't know what's stussy. Okay, this is me. I'm a jacket. All right, it's my turn. I I am going with the Supreme <gasps> Strawberry. Oh, it's so. I just, I feel like it's something I'd wear a lot. Like, I really like the Renaissance painting. And I might want to borrow cute. that sometime. Yeah, and again, it's not like, hey, this is mine. You can never see it again. We should. Yeah, I sort of like these orange pants. Oh, the orange is pro orange. How much are these? We didn't know. These are we? 130 a piece. What size are they? 36. Should I try them on? 
Because I don't want them if I can't wear them. Here, go off camera. <laughs> Are we on film? Okay, guys. Whoa. No. I Okay, don't look at my fat gut. They're so tiny. Okay, don't show that on camera. We're deleting the fact that you just Here. beat your butt on camera. You can't see, but look, hold my leg they're up. very long. Hold my leg up. <laughs> I mean, that just, I, <laughs> all right. Cut, I, yeah, I'm I used to them pants. either. So all these okay. pants are going to be so. All right, I need a new item. Oh, right, she's back. So no pants for Meg. Yeah, all these didn't fit us. Yeah, and um, okay, so that's, okay. and these jeans are the same size, so we're probably going to have to sell these. But these retail for like 700 I don't think I would want them either way. So all the jeans are going to be sold. I don't know. I sort of feel like if you got one, should I get one? Or is this too big for us to wear? I think it would look so cute with the right thing. You know, like some jeans and like it's super baggy. You want to try sliding it on? It might be showing. It's so bougie. Uh. Maybe. Um, they don't sell for that much though. They sell for like 200 Tore two hundred. That's a that's a lot of money. I think you should keep it. I don't know. Cause it's the look. You gotta be like really oversized. I don't. I don't know. I'm gonna go with the vest. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That was I'm a going with the vest. Okay, well, here's another curveball. I'm going with the sunset jacket. I, I thought you were gonna go with no. That. I keep looking at it. I really like this brand. Oh, and wait, I like did this I get silhouette. something? Yeah, I got this shirt. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So we're each taking a two thousand dollars. Mine's five hundred. Yours is twenty two hundred retail. This Which doesn't really make sense to me. This no, I think that that's the wrong price. No, I looked on the website for these. How much is it? This one retailed for five hundred. This one retailed for twenty two hundred. Maybe it's because of all the like texture and. Okay. What the heck? All right. So next, I think I might go with. So are you really not wearing this? I think I might. I don't know. I, I'm you wear a lot of crewnecks. You wear them like all the time. I know. But that's the thing. I, you have to look at what you'll really wear. I think this is this, this does look big on me, but I don't like the towel. Or I don't we, like the potatoes. Are we potatoes. going with matching these? Uh, I don't yeah, know. Where's the other one? of the girl in the aroma. Or here. Oh, yeah. Are we going with matching these? <laughs> Should we take one? Uh, which are they? The ones with the girl in the. And this apple. is the one we can't figure out, right? Yeah. Which one is this? Oh, that's the <gasps> Grand oh, Pixel. Oh, it's really nice. One. I sort of like this. I kind of like it too. Okay, I'm gonna go with this. Okay, I'm gonna do something crazy and go with this one. <gasps> I thought you would do Givenchy. I I think I like this one a little bit more just because I like the story at the bottom. If though. you get both of those, that's over a thousand dollars in two. The I I can't even fathom. I don't even want to drink or eat in my clothes. <laughs> All right, so that's mine. Oh my gosh. Okay. So what do we have left? These two are claimed. Uh, we have the prayer rug, which automatically. Oh, the basketball uniform. Yeah. So we I think. I don't know. I kind of want the jersey. Like, is that crazy? I think it's kind of hype. And as long as I take care of it, I can always sell it in the future. Can we just sell the shorts. Okay. So we'll sell the shorts. So so far, nobody jersey. wants any pants. These okay. are never gonna fit. Let me see if I can try these on. Tori's gonna try this on. Okay. Come in, coach. Okay. I can play, coach. I can play. Actually, honey, it doesn't. It's it. this is too big, but I kind of like the shirts. Shirts are cute, but well, I don't. I don't really want to separate them. All right. This is so big. wait a minute. We left off. It was your turn because you were trying to pick. Okay, honey. And I think this is gonna be a sale. Okay. This so. is kind of ridiculous, but it's cute. Like you're gonna go for the Givenchy. Yes, I am. Who doesn't pick a five hundred dollar T-shirt? Yeah. All right. Yeah. And then I don't know what this is. But I'm gonna go for this. Uh, yeah, it is a cute brand. I, I they have like a really this. good message behind them, actually. I, like I do work. like this. Okay, so are we done? Or are we gonna sell everything that's left? Um, I kind of like the Sinclair. Well, like I said, I could see. Because the thing is, yeah, like she said, if I like tie it back and make it look do you cute, have, you have the green tank Lululemon. Yeah. And I think if you just tie it, that's really cute. I think so too. But I think other than this, everything can be sell. Everything on the table we're going to sell. Everything that's left. That's still a lot of clothing. So everything else will be sold. Tor, come on. Let's do a recap. Hold on. All right. So 
I'm telling you, it's amazing. And this is what we got. Welcome to the recap. Okay, guys, so we're going to talk about the suitcase a little bit and kind of like prices versus resale and yeah. just some more information. So, Pepper, would you like to break down? She did all the research. So what I did was I did an inventory of everything that I possibly could, not including the um, one that looked like a used uniform from a college or something. Yeah. So we had basically 29 items out of how many did we originally have? 30. 30 I think 30. 30, 30 something, 31 or 32, whatever. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I couldn't not find everything. So um, I have two lists of prices. One is retail because like you've seen, a lot of the stuff does have the price tags on it. So that was pretty easy. And the other one is actually reselling uh, comps, uh, things that have sold through Poshmark, um, Depop, uh, what's eBay, eBay and different things. A couple things, they don't exist. Yeah, it was really hard because some it, of these pieces are like limited drops, small brands. It's just difficult. And they just came out in fall of 2023, a couple pieces. Something. So I think the people love them and they're not reselling them. Because yeah. there's no place to resell. Okay, I'm rambling. So anyway, what I did was I added up and the first um, is our retail value is... Dun, dun, dun. Oh my gosh. Are, are we not going to go through individual? Should we? Okay, let's just, I'm going to spit fire and go through quickly. The Louis Vuitton denim jacket is retail $2,890, resale 3600 And that is if you could find it. Yeah, that, that's the thing is, if you're like, man, why is it going for more? It's, it's sold out. It's sold out. It's sold out. They don't everywhere. know if they're going to get it back in. And mm -hmm. somebody actually has it on Poshmark, I believe it is. For six thousand, yeah, that's not totally accurate, but still, resale we put three thousand six hundred because that's what we saw. Uh, the butterfly logo long sleeve was <laughs> here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you saw it. Uh, retail eighty, resale eighty. And maybe we shouldn't do everything because I am going to put comps up throughout the video. Oh, okay. So maybe just cut this whole part. Okay, yeah. The retail total on the suitcase ended up being twelve thousand five hundred and thirty-two dollars. And if you do tax, it's $13,409. Oh and then if you added in possibly the chance that I had to make up prices and I was conservative on a couple of things, like the one pair of pants, yeah. the one, um, we still can't find the Sinclair or anything. I, I There were a couple of things I cannot find. It's just too hard. It's just, it's going to be really close to 15000 Yeah. Considering, like, again, limited edition stuff that just isn't made anymore. And it's potentially never been sold. So it was really crazy to actually try to look into these. And the crazy thing for me was, again, retail was about $13,000. Resale value, adding up what it's going for sold, $10,183. If we could find it. But I did find quite a few things sold. But some stuff, it just, like I said, it doesn't exist. I know, but still, to me, this is insane because, like, as resellers, 13000 retail, 10000 resale. It is insane to me how these pieces hold their value so well. I mean, I know that's a lot, a big reason a lot of people will collect designer is they'll be like, oh, you know, it's limited edition, whatever. They'll keep it for a few years and sell it for more. So it's really incredible to see just how high the resale is. And I was just going to show the last thing on the list is the prayer rug. Oh, the prayer rug. I only put 20 bucks on that. And I didn't even add it to the resale value. That's true. I didn't. So there's things that we didn't. I know. So okay. it's, it's insane. The thing I wanted to tell you about was when we were picking. You saw each of us pick what we wanted, mm -hmm. and we had a lot of fun. So much fun. And oh this goodness. was like a bonus because we did not pay the price that we thought we did. So we had like a shopping spree. So what happened during that was my <laughs> items that I picked, I own. If I choose mm -hmm. to sell them, I could sell them. I could keep them, wear them, or do anything I want with them. That, those are mine, and that's my money. Mm -hmm. And then Tories is the same. Yeah, same thing. I might decide to sell some of them. Well, like you said, the shorts. You weren't sure. Yeah, I love the shorts, but they fit me really tight, and I don't think that's the look for what I would like. And um, the cleaning. 
How do you clean those? Yeah, cleaning leather shorts with giant iron patches. Don't know about that one. Guys, we live in the middle of nowhere in Ohio, and we have to drive 30 miles to a dry cleaner. Yeah, and we're also like 30 minutes away from any Walmarts or anything. So we're we're kind of out in the middle of nowhere. That is something worth pointing out. Um, wearing these kind of clothes is kind of weird where we live. Um, we love it. It's a form of like self-expression. Well, I have on the Prada shirt today. Yeah, you're not a good example. Thanks, Jim. My friend Lego Jim, um, oh, yeah. who's been in some of the videos, he gave this to me uh, because... He couldn't sell it. I want to show you. Look at this gigantic stain. <laughs> it's a big stain. <laughs> yeah. And actually, it's faded. I've washed it maybe four times or five since I've worn it. And each time, I, like, spray it constantly. But thanks, Jim. I appreciate it. She wears it a lot. I do. I love um, it. But, yeah, anyway, wearing this kind of stuff where we live in the country, it's not very common. I mean, especially those... I mean, look at this crazy Louis Vuitton denim jacket. You just don't see that kind of stuff around here. Can you see me walking in Kroger? <laughs> I need some yeah, Cheez-Its. So <laughs> we were thinking about making Spaghetti a video. sauce. <laughs> we were thinking about making some sort of video talking about, Looking like, at sale meat with the $3,000 jacket. Need you to relax. <laughs> anyway, we were thinking about making a video talking about, like, how we wear the pieces, why we wear the pieces, that kind of stuff. And again, I call them pieces rather than clothing because I think they are artwork, really. Yeah. I mean, most of them. So, yeah. Basically, let us know what you guys think in the comments. I mean, everything here was so incredible. Have you guys ever seen anyone get this kind of stuff? I mean, a lot of these brands I haven't even really heard of, so... Okay, another thing I wanted to say too, back before we got rambling on my money, my picks, Tori's money, her picks, and then you saw everything else that was oh, left wow. on the table, mm -hmm. all that money will be reinvested. So instead of having to reinvest and sell $1,000 or whatever we thought we were going to have to pay, mm -hmm. we don't have to do that anymore. No. So it's going to be a bonus. So yeah. yes, that was bonus the one money. thing I mm -hmm. wanted to tell you. That's all going to be um, reinvested. Then I have to tell you something about me. I am a very practical person. So um, this auction was like a day or two ago and I've had time to stare and admire my jacket. So in the vest and oh no, all, all I think of is we need a new couch. And, no. And we You're not need, selling your jacket. She has wanted, well, I have she has wanted person. this jacket. For years. Well, a honey, Vuitton, that style just came yeah, out. Yeah, no, but a Louis Vuitton denim jacket. If I you know. watch our videos, she'll cut up fabric. And oh, make I make own. fakes all the time. I make my own Louis Vuitton jacket. You deserve to keep but it. But I, I just mean, think of that couch is so old. It's like 15 years old. It has some stains. And then I think we have like a couple little home repairs I want to do. So I don't know. I, I've been thinking about it a lot in the last 24 practical. hours. And what I'm going to do is... I'm gonna put it somewhere where I could stay around it a couple times a day, walking past. I'm not gonna take the tags off, and I'm gonna wait a week to decide. Yeah. So leave comments if you have bills to pay. No, no, no. I mean, leave comments if you have any thoughts or votes on that. You yeah. Know. Well, right. I just thought too, if I could keep anything, you know, if I kept that Louis Vuitton necklace that you saw on video auction number two, the video, one you didn't want to keep, the one I didn't want to keep, I could have that necklace for the rest of my life. Yeah, but where, you also where have that spill coffee on that. You know? Okay, well, anyway, that's it, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed it. Is there anything else you want to share about this big haul? Nothing, other than the fact that I'm scared to take off the tags on some of the pieces. I mean, some I won't for Are a while. Are you really going to wear the 500 or $700? $700 t-shirt. Givenchy? Givenchy, yeah. It's my favorite thing, honestly. The or would you rather stuff. have... Six hundred or, or five hundred dollar or, or, pile of cash. In would I you. rather go see My Chemical Romance <laughs> out at the When We Were Young festival? All right. Well, anyway, okay. This is it. This is it, guys. Um, seriously, leave some comments. I'm dying to know what you guys think. This is insane. Um, have a wonderful day. And please like and subscribe. And join us on our next adventure, which is going to be a reseller. Uh, scavenger oh. hunt with our friends, our reseller friends, 
and it's going to be like sort of for Easter. Yeah. It's going to be fun. Reseller Easter hunt at the bins. Yeah. Stay All right. tuned. Stay tuned, guys. Thanks Bye. for joining us. Oh, no hate comments. Be our no, okay, friend okay. if you want to buy no, something no, no, for no, a no, good no, no, prize. No. Leave your opinions, ask questions, but be polite. Bye, guys. Bye.